Hi, this uh, little video is about uh, making uh, a cheapskate prepping light, emergency light, using old vegetable oil. Um, the idea of it is it's having a bit of free light and um, it's there if you need it in an emergency. Uh, so what I just got this just siphoning in at the moment, so I'll stop that, put that up there, into there. This is a little system I use. I um, put the old vegetable oil into there. Then I put it into this gallon container through an old piece of, uh, well, I think it's a tights, I think, or a pop sock. Uh, so this, this bit takes out all the little crispy bits. And then uh, what I do, put that in the garage, let it sit for, well, how long it needs to be. And then I'll show you, usually pour most of that in because of the, so that bottle can go for recycling. Yeah, as I was saying, as you can see, I've left the, the bit coming out of the container a couple of inches above the bottom and what happens, the fat in the, the oil um, sinks to the bottom, the good oil sits there, the bits sit inside the filter, so that's my little free oil system um, and it does mix with uh, diesel well, if you know what I mean. Right, so my idea is um, sardine can or the little silver trays from the cakes because i thought well if you're on backpacking or something all you gotta do is carry these a bit of oil in a bottle um i'm using an old uh, metal bottle top and um and a piece of cord so and uh, what you do is you knock a hole into the bottle top which I've done already obviously then uh, that's a little bit precise because you don't want it too tight and you don't want it too loose because if it's too loose it slips back and if it's too tight it won't let it draw right so there's the the wick in place so I don't know how long it's going to take to uh, start the draw You know, I haven't really got enough in in there at the moment for it to float. But uh, let's see if we get the general idea. If it lights or not. I suppose I could put that back in for a moment. And let it top up a bit more. So a bit of a slow process to be honest. Well what I'll do is I'll take it out of there for a moment and I'll put it in the backpacker's emergency. That's it, she's dripping into there so I'll leave that. Well it, it, it does, um, as you can see, it does so cut through. don't know if it's uh, high enough so I do not intend to well something's burning Probably I got a bit too much wick on the bottom, might have to uh, revise that, but um, as you can see it does work. It's, uh, it'd be very light to carry, chuck in uh, bits in a little bag. Well there we are, it works. I 
might take a while to fill. Definitely want a little bit more oil in there, and probably a little bit less um, less wick. But that's what it's all about: learning and adapting. I suppose, yeah, you got to see what you're doing, but you ain't going to get blinded, are you? But I suppose uh, it's better than nothing. Like I said, a bit of emergency lighting. Thanks for watching.